Good afternoon and thank you for joining us on Wavy News 10 Midday. I'm Don Rock. And I'm Carrie Fury. Our top story right now, something that happened today in downtown Norfolk. Tell you sides following a developing story in downtown Norfolk where a gas leak caused quite a scare hours ago. That leak forced several evacuations in the area. It also forced light rail to stop running through downtown. Tenor your side, Stephanie Harris in, is live in Norfolk. Stephanie, what's happening there right now? Well, Carrie, take a look behind me. You can see pretty much it's back to business as usual downtown. The fire department says they have been inside the buildings that were evacuated. They did some air testing and cleared them. They say it's safe to go back inside, although some businesses decided to go ahead and shut down for the day. Now, here's what started the whole problem. Look behind me. You see that uh, orange digger over there on a construction site where they're doing some work behind the library. Uh, we can't get you down there right now to see, but we have some video we shot a while ago, so take a look. This is the problem right here. It is the gas line that that construction company hit. Now, the name of that construction company is Title Construction. I talked to a fire captain, Mike Hicks, and he told me that the construction team here had the full plans for this area and that Miss Utility had been out here to mark it for safety. He says it appears that the construction crew used an excavator to dig in that area in parts where they should have been digging by hand. I was unable to reach anyone with that company for comment, but uh, Captain Hicks tells me the fire marshal's office will cite that company and the company will have to pay for fire and rescue and any other city response out here. As for, uh, you know, the missed time at offices around here, well, I don't know about that, but I did talk to some of the workers and they described what it was like when the alarm went off inside of the tower down here saying, this is not a drill, get out ASAP. Okay, well, unfortunately, we didn't have that sound there for you, but they told me uh, that it took them what seemed like about 20 minutes to get down the stairs there as they weren't able to use the elevator, but I'm told things went pretty smoothly. There's a lot of military folks that work in this, uh, in this tower behind me, so as you can imagine, they have been practicing for this um, much ahead of time. Again, some of those people did go home for the day. They said it kind of smelled inside. Their bosses let them go home, and as you can imagine, we didn't hear too many complaints about that. Donna Carey? All right, not on a yeah. Friday afternoon like this. Thanks very much, Stephanie Harris. Glad nobody was hurt. Mm -hmm. The scene is clear, and uh, we will follow the outcome of this story in the days to come. All right.